Welcome to our YouTube channel where we explore the exciting intersection of virtual reality, VR, and augmented reality, R. In this video, we will dive deep into what VR and R are, how they work, and the ways in which they intersect. First, let's define what VR and R are. VR is a computer-generated environment that simulates a realistic experience. This is typically done through the use of a headset that tracks the user's head movements and displays a 360-degree view of the environment, creating the illusion of being fully immersed in a virtual world. R, on the other hand, overlays computer-generated content onto the real world, allowing users to see digital information and objects within their physical environment. This is typically done through the use of a smartphone or tablet, although our headsets are also becoming more common. While VR and R are often discussed as separate technologies, they actually have a lot of overlap. Both technologies rely on computer-generated content to create immersive experiences, and both can be used to enhance learning, entertainment, and even social interaction. However, there are some key differences between the two. One of the main differences between VR and R is the level of immersion they offer. VR provides a fully immersive experience, transporting users to a completely different world. R, on the other hand, overlays digital content onto the real world, allowing users to see and interact with both at the same time. This makes R a great tool for applications like education, where students can learn about a subject while still seeing and interacting with their physical surroundings. Another key difference between VR and R is the hardware required to use each technology. VR typically requires a high-end headset that can be expensive and cumbersome to use. R, on the other hand, can be accessed using a smartphone or tablet, which is much more accessible and affordable for most people. Despite these differences, the intersection of VR and R is where things get really interesting. By combining the two technologies, developers can create experiences that are even more immersive and interactive. For example, imagine wearing a VR headset that allows you to explore a fully realized virtual world, while also using R to overlay real-world objects and information onto that world. This would allow users to interact with both the virtual and physical worlds in new and exciting ways. One area where the intersection of VR and R is already being explored is in the realm of gaming. For example, the game Pokemon Go uses R to allow players to see and capture virtual Pokemon in the real world. This is a great example of how R can enhance a game by bringing it into the real world, and we can expect to see more games like this in the future. Another area where VR and R intersect is in education. For example, medical students can use VR to simulate surgeries while also using R to overlay information onto the surgical field. This can help students learn more quickly and effectively by providing a more immersive and interactive learning experience. The intersection of VR and R also has potential in the business world. For example, architects can use VR to create 3D models of buildings, while also using R to overlay those models onto the real world. This can help clients visualize the finished product in a more tangible way, and can also aid in the construction process by providing a more accurate representation of the final design. In conclusion, the intersection of VR and R is an exciting area of technology that has the potential to revolutionize the way we interact with the world around us. Whether it's in gaming, education, or business, the combination of these two technologies has the potential to create experiences that are more immersive, interactive, and engaging than ever before. Thank you for watching this video and learning more about the intersection of VR and R. If you enjoyed this content, please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like.